Hunter Collector here with another video. Before the video starts, I want to let you guys know to make sure you hit that subscribe and notification button. It really helps out showing the support for the channel. I do a bunch of other stuff besides gaming. I do drawing, building, collecting, uh, workouts, cooking, um, and then a bunch of other cool stuff with my friends. Um, and if you want to, me to put, be posting more videos each day, make sure you hit that subscribe button and let me know. Uh, but besides that, let's get right into the video. Alright, so here's the Iron Man 2020 uh, armor suit that I have. I got it from Walgreens. It's a Walgreens exclusive. Here's the front. You have all the different blast effects. Um, and then here's the side artwork here. Looks pretty cool. Here's the back if you want to. Pause and read this. And then here's the DCBI. And then top. Iron Man logo, um, but besides that, let's crack this thing open. And here he is out of the packaging. I like how he looks. Um, he has various different accessories. So let's start with the accessories first. So he has two of these blast effects here, orange, and then he like clears up at the end. It's pretty cool. And then as these, uh, these are for, supposed to be for like, I guess, to make sure he stays put when you put him on these. These are supposed to go in his foot, just like this here. So you put it in like that. There we go. And you just pour them in. Um, and then, yeah, you can't really get him into just one. You have to do both. I wonder if I can get him. There we go. Yeah, I got him to stay balanced like that with just, well, not, never mind. Um, so yeah, mo you, you will most likely have to have him into a, both of these to make it work. Um, so, and then it also comes with two fisted hands. Uh, they have hinges. Um, and then... It also comes with the blasting hands, but they don't have like the wrist hinge effects like the new ones do here. Let's see, it has no articulation in there. I wish they did with this figure, but they didn't. Um, but besides that, for that's all I've got for the accessories. So let's go over the look of the figure. I like how he looks. I never heard of anything about Iron Man 2020 until this figure came out. I, I like how he looks. Um, it's basically the same body mold as the uh, the Invincible Iron Man or the classic Iron Man Marvel Avengers from um, what is it the 80th anniversary figure. Uh, they used the same one. They just see you can tell this by that, and they just have this glued on, just padding, and then they have this for the waist. It's basically the same figure, just has this extra stuff, and then this is a new uh, head mold for it. I like how that face looks, the mouth looks cool. And then this is pretty cool too. And I would think it'd be pretty weird to have that in there, especially like in the armpit area. You wouldn't, you would probably walk around like like this kinda if you did that. But um. I like how the paint looks metallic. The foots look real cool. Um, I think the feet and hand red paint is a little different, like a darker shade than the torso. Um, but the gold looks pretty consistent. I don't see anything wrong with the figure. I like how the this the red here. They use like the same red color for the. Uh, from the first Iron Man, like first Iron Man movie figures. Um, but besides that, I think that's all we have for the looks. Uh, let's go over the articulation. So let me fix my camera up here. So you get his head to move up that far, down pretty good. And then he has and very little head pivot. You can get him to look four, I mean, 
all around here. Um, and then arms can move up pretty darn far down that much. Uh, 360 rotation, bicep swivel, double jointed elbows. Um, like I said with the fists, this does not have any articulation, this does. Um, and then the ab crunch goes up down that far goes back that far and then it has 360 waist rotation here his legs could kick out that far uh he could kick forward that far forward back very little dumbbell jointed knees pretty good um shin cut or boot cut um angles can move up that far down that far and ankle pivot um but yeah but that's all i've got for this figure he's really cool um my only gripe would be probably this um you can't really turn it out around like that without him falling you have to get him perfectly balanced kind of but he will be on my like multiverse shelf that i have going on like he's about to fall right now yeah, I wish they had like a little more stable kind of blast effects like that, but um, I heard like, I think I remember they're gonna do the same thing with these for the War Machine, classic War Machine figure. Um, but I will try getting it and do a review on him. But I like this figure, it's really cool. Um, but besides that, that's all I've got for him. So uh, that's it for the video. Okay, so for today's shout out goes to all that jazz 420. He has an Instagram. Here it is. And then here's his YouTube. He does really cool stuff. He does stop motion. He does collecting like I do. Make sure you check him out. He's the one that guessed this figure, Iron Man 2020. Um, good job. And I like the comment like, uh, what was it? Um, 20, uh, Iron Man 2020. Uh, the worst Iron Man for the worst year, which is true. So, uh, good job at guessing, and thank you for all of you who also guessed that actor uh, character correctly and uh, posted it on the story, your guys' story, and tagged me. And also, thank you to MCU Collector for like helping me reach out to others too. I thought it would be a pretty cool idea to have like other people try to guess these characters or figures um, that adds a little more fun into um, the YouTube, my YouTube. Um, but yeah, uh, make sure you check out his Instagram and uh, YouTube at all that jazz 420. All right, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Make sure you check out my buddy's Instagram page at Highlight Photos. He does really cool photos. Also, my two best friends that I usually play Call of Duty with, sometimes with other games. They have card pages. Christian's card page is BadBuke767. Uh, Connor's card page, well, he doesn't really have one at the moment. His Jeep's gone. He has a new car. I will update it when he like decides to put up an Instagram page for it. Um, to uh, sending, donating to my PayPal. It's supposed to help me out with getting Get me being able to do that and I'll also get more games uh, to do reactions to. I want to get the PS5, uh, I'll do a review on it and then also the games for it. Um, more camera, better camera equipment uh, and a few other things to help make the views a little bit better. And then oh, uh, I will try putting up my own merch store at some point. I just need time to do it. I'm in the middle of baseball right now. I will figure out some way to do it. I do not have a laptop myself at the moment. So if you guys could help me out by donating to my PayPal, it would be really awesome. But besides that, I, um, if you really enjoy my nerdy, funny, gaming, uh, workout, uh, sports, videos, other stuff like that. Uh, make sure you like and subscribe and I'll see you next time.